Hi, this is Matt from Audio Plugin Deals. Today we're looking at Jammerhook, which is an AI sound matching tool. It's currently on offer from Audio Plugin Deals, so let's have a look how it works. Right, so what is Jammerhook then? As you can see from their website, it is the world's only AI sound matching. So let's test it out then. Let's go back to Cubase, like so. So the way it works is you click on match first, and then it says, please play back audio. So if I play back four bars, it will listen to that audio and then it will suggest samples that it thinks matches to what it's just heard. And then just like that, it has split it up into harmony, rhythm and drums. So it thinks this Fox sample would work with this track. So let's play this back and let's see if we agree. You'll notice also that when I play it back, this sample has automatically been time stretched and pitch corrected, which is quite impressive. Play this back and press play and it will start at the start. Just wait for it to come back again in another bar here. So it's certainly working, but it's not really what I'm going for in this track at the moment. I might also expand or unmute a couple of these tracks and just give it more to work with. And I can also help it out by clicking on this filter option here. And we're going to choose a genre trap. I could also choose an instrument if I want, but I don't really know that yet. I'm kind of stuck on this track. I don't really know where to go next. So I'm going to let Jammerhook help me with that. And we'll play this back and we'll let it search again so what do we have now we have a bit of an effect I think instantly those last two would actually work quite well. I really like that. So once you've found one that you like, click on buy and it will take it out of your credits. And we click on this little button here and drag it to the project. It needs to prepare the loop. And it takes a second. And then drag that into the project like so. And as you can see, it is perfectly time stretched it exactly to the project tempo. So now if I play this back, obviously it's very loud. Let's turn this down. There was another one also that I liked. So let's have a listen to that one. It was this one here, I think, Hitchhiker. Yeah, it's okay, it doesn't really go with the vibe I'm going for. I should point out also that there are two versions of Jammerhook. There is an online and an offline version. The offline searches your own samples from your own sample library, which ones it thinks will fit. But this is the online version that I'm looking at now. And the online version uses Jammerhook's own sample database.
Let's maybe go over to Rhythm, see what Rhythm has to offer. So this loop here highlights, I think, one of the major benefits of Gemma Hook. It suggests samples that I never would have thought would work in the track at all. So now I'm suddenly starting to think that maybe a breakbeat or a light breakbeat on top of that would actually work quite well. So let's mark that as a favorite. Let's mark that one out. I'm also liking that one. Let's have a look at drums. So I'm loving that. Really loving that. So that one's definitely getting added. There's another one. The problem actually is starting to become quite evident. There are too many that I'm enjoying. Let's now have a look at the instrument filters and see what we have. So quite a few options, as you can see, I'm not obviously going to read them out, but let's find one that we like the sound of. Let's go for glitched. And we'll take it off trap and then we'll put it on, well, let's just take off the genre completely. So now we have every genre and we do apply. Okay, that's sounding awesome. Oh, I like this one. Okay, let's grab this one. Thank <laughs> you. 
And prior to recording, I was having quite a bit of fun and I found these ones that also work really well. So let's mute what we had just now and play back what I created earlier. So we have this vocal. Your disguise. Dogs. And this little bit of a top loop. Ice. And then this bass line here. Loving that bass. Make it paralyze. Fix a paradise. Here come let me paraphrase. And let's see how the new ones fit with that. Your disguise. Dogs. Maybe it's a bit too much. Dines. Take you up to paradise Parasites Beats to make it paralyzed Bit of low end to make the fit in a bit better Here come let me paraphrase Foodies eagle eyes Your disguise Dogs Dines Take you up to paradise Parasites I'm just loving this thing, it's so easy. As a sample finder, it's hugely effective, but also just as an idea generator. I really had no idea what I wanted from this track, I was a bit lost with ideas. But then I just generated a few hits, played back a couple, and then instantly I was, I found direction again for the track. And now I'm at a point where I have too many samples, I need to start taming it back or start working on the arrangement to make them all fit in. And they all just seem to work so well. Like that's another one that could easily fit. That's similar to the one we had, if actually it's the same one. You could definitely create an entire track with this within, honestly, within half an hour. So go check it out on Audio Plugin Deals. It's currently heavily discounted, but be prepared to spend hours and hours and hours having fun with it. It really is an excellent tool. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.